whenever Ange is going to go on air on weekends. That's only for special occasions. And it's extra special today because I'm here on a Sunday. <laughs> you know what that is? If you have followed us across all social media platforms, you know what's happening in the world and the city. We got to our first ever. It's like, um, what do you call that? It's a momentous occasion that someone decided to make a drag show like a whole drag show here in cebu and of course um he got one of the very talented drag artists in well manila and of course i just want to introduce her from the bottom of my heart i am very i am a big fan and i don't know if i can survive this interview but let me introduce to Southside, precious paula nicole hi hello welcome hi, to <laughs> Mabuhay, and welcome to Monster. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, so much. Thank you so much for being here. Um, yes. I really appreciate it. I appreciate you know giving us time, um, dropping by. I know um, you guys are very. Um, what do you call that? You guys are very. At least the people in RX, RX Manila wants want to talk to you guys like individually all drag race contestants oh nga eh. na actually meron ako invitation kasi sabi ko ipapapaalam ko muna oh okay yes. okay okay mas nakalimutan ko na magpaalam <laughs> 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 so sorry po <laughs> But we got precious Paula Nicole. If you don't yes. know us outside, um, she is currently a Drag Race uh, Philippines contestant. The season one, right? Yes. The first ever season. Yeah. And she's part of that. We're going to probably brush off from that and ask how she felt when she got casted. She's also um, a commercial model. I just found that out last week. <laughs> And on top, I was watching on top, I was like, she's a commercial model. Like, oh, oh she's a commercial model. How it, it was, a, <laughs> it was a, a, a junk food brand, right? Yeah. Ooh, can I, okay. can I mention the name? Yeah, yeah please. Fish that. Fish fish that. that. Mm, so I found that. Yeah, nakatawan kasi, ano, parang whole day ako nakaginito. Oh. <laughs> Oh, kasi ako yung drag, <laughs> ano, drag version ng fish na. Okay. Uh, so, pati sa audition, nakaganan lang din ako din. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, oh yeah, my sana, goodness. Sana palabas ko ba yun? Hindi na yata. Um, I saw that trending on YouTube over the weekend. Oh? Because, I, I think, well, probably because I watched too much Drag Race. <laughs> and it was just like, oh, it's there. Oh, oh, this is the commercial that they were talking about. I'm like, oh. Okay, <laughs> that one. What else? Is, what else do you have on your portfolio aside from being a commercial model? Uh, I'm uh, a former beauty queen. Okay. Just chilling. <laughs> <laughs> oh come on. No, I'm a full-time drag queen mm, for okay. 12 years now. Oh, this year. Oh. Years now. Pero before po, before ako maging drag queen, I was a professional dancer, mm. cultural dancer. All right, all right. We're gonna talk about that. Yes. Dragon D, da, da, you know. Uh, talk about like your journey to drag, how you found it, and of course, you know, how you, how the, well, how are you feeling now that you have a more mainstream audience, right? Because I know you already currently have an audience even prior to Drag Race, but I think it is bigger now. Would you say so that it's bigger, bigger now? Bigger talaga, as in, parang times, times 10, times oh. 10 yung, uh, supporters namin ngayon. Mm -hmm. kasi, Finally, actually, ito muna kabado kami. Oh. Kasi feeling namin hindi siya ganun katanggapin dito sa Philippines. The drag race? Yes, the drag oh, race. Oh, okay, may okay. Ako, ako may ganun akong feeling. Pero yeah, grabe kahit kagabi. I know! Oh, sana nakapunta yung iba. Yeah, yeah. But you're also gonna have a second show. We're gonna talk about yes. that later. So yeah, I am happy that you're here. Thank you so much for at least giving us a couple of your hour, or at least an hour of your time here in Cebu yeah. because this is the first time that you're here in the city. Mm -hmm. So I hope Cebuanos are treating you well. Mm -hmm. Sabi nga you're welcome. I? Thank you then for inviting me because the first time I was going to Cebu. Oh. Yes, before I was airing uh, Drag Race, I was planning to travel. I wanted to go to Cebu. Mm. So, so brang timing talaga. Uh, yeah, thank you. What what places do you want to visit Cebu? Uh, the uh, here, uh, Bantayan. I want to go to Bantayan. <laughs> Bantayan, yes. Because <laughs> I have a friend there. Oh, okay. I want to visit. Mm -hmm. It's uh, kung saan pa ang gusto ko sa beach talaga. Gusto ko mm -hmm. ng So, uh, hopefully, makapag uh, tayo. Hopefully. Makapag, hopefully. Fingers uh, crossed. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Fingers mm -hmm. crossed. All right. So, again, we'll be talking to you. Um, we are live on Facebook, facebook.com slash bt1059. If you want to see Precious, um, this is 
um, out of drag, you know, it is, it, it, it was awesome watching you last night. I was there. I was, I was amazed, but yeah, I'm probably just going to stop talking because I'm blabbering. I feel like it's weird that you're talking to a fan. Is it weird talking to a no. fan? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> never, never, never. Okay, okay. So I don't treat my fans as fans. I mm. treat them as my friends, mm -hmm. you know, mga bagong kakilala, kaya... Mm. It's all right, fine. all right, all right, all right. How about this? Let's just get back to the tracks before I blabber more. Um, let's play a Rihanna song, um, a song, a perfect song to dance to this uh, sunny Sunday. Sunday, I really feel like it's a Saturday, but it's a Sunday afternoon here at the Monster. We're playing that, um, hip hop and R&B tracks, Rihanna, all the way to four in the afternoon. And Precious Paula Nicole will be live here with us, so stay tuned. <laughs> Thought it's Monster BT 105.9. Good girls going bad. That happened um, last night, actually. The first ever um, full on production drag show um, with the precious Paula Nicole. Um, so, so, something is playing. Wait, something is playing. Wait, something is playing. So, I can hear that. All right. <laughs> that was me. Okay, but yeah, that, that was what happened last night. If you missed the show, then all you can do is just probably watch it um, on social media, probably follow where the, the place is at because the tickets are sold out. Unfortunately, we don't accept, oh, what? And we do have? We do have limited seats. Oh, we do have, yes. We do have very limited seats. So yeah, but there's always gonna be a next time. Um, there is an important, or there is a special announcement courtesy of the producer himself. We talked to him um, last week and we're probably gonna talk to him real soon. Yes, okay, he gave me a thumbs up. Anyways, it's 3.20 in the afternoon. We're still live here at the station with a very special, 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 I don't know how many special I can probably say, but it's a very special guest here. Um, again, she's a drag race PH alumni of a first ever season. That for that matter, <laughs> precious Paula Nicole is here. Hello. 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 Precious <laughs> afternoon. A precious <laughs> afternoon <laughs> to you. And maganda hapon din po sa mga nakikinig at sa nanonood sa Facebook Live. My precious loves, din chan. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Ayun, wala silang tigil. Inaasok pa nila ako. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> so if you don't, uh, if you, if you want to follow us on Facebook, facebook.com slash BT1059. Watch the live stream um, or as we do the interview. Now, before anything else, before we formally start the interview, I want to know, what Visaya words have you been learning for the past few hours <laughs> since you've been here in Cebu? <laughs> <laughs> Wala pa masyado. Daghang salamat pa lang. Okay, which is uh, thank you. Thank you. Maayong hapon. Maayong hapon. Maayong hapon. Uh -huh, which is good afternoon. Maayong umaga. Buntag. Pero tulog pa ako kanina umaga kaya may mali yung narinig ko. Well, maayong buntag. Buntag, yes. Which is good morning. And the uh, the latter would be maayong gabi. -i. Maayong gabi. -i. Yes, so, which yeah. is good evening. Mm -hmm. Okay. What do you want to learn? Um, any other Bisaya words oh, specifically? Yes. Mm, yes. Th th I saw you yesterday, and you were shocked that people were circling around you. Mm -hmm. Did you get the reference for that? No. no. Uh, okay. So w when the drag, the you had a performance last night. So outside, if you don't know, Precious already gave out you know full on performance last night, and you were dancing with the Cebu drag community, mm -hmm. right? And they were circling you. Oh uh, yes, the beat senior. <laughs> yes, oh. it's a very big thing here in Cebu. Oh. So yeah, that was really awesome. Thank it you. was like culture clashing. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> videos ang ganda nun, um, Yeah. Ano yun sa yun? Nung bang sabi ko, ang ginagawa ng mga bakula. Ito mga to. Wala naman ito sa pinag-usapan namin. <laughs> Pero ang, ang, ang galing, ang galing. Ang galing mm -hmm. mga queens natin dito sa Cebu. All right. And of course, you know, we have, we always make sure that they have an avenue um, for them to, uh, do, to be free to mm -hmm. do their art. Now, question. Let's formally start this um, interview. When oh. did this drag journey of yours start i feel like nasa confessional so it's a new day it's a new day to work bro <laughs> how did i start that when, when did you start um 12 years ago 12, 12 years ago so yes. technically that's 2010. Mm -mm, 2010 oh okay how did how did that start like what was like the first ever introduction you had in drag um you partner to that time mm -hmm. uh Sinama ako sa isang uh, comedy bar na may mm -hmm. mga nag-show din na drag queens. So, mm -hmm. I went to disco bar. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was my first experience of uh, 
na makakita talaga ng drag queens, yes. And uh, gusto niyang sumali sa mga pageants kasi may mga pageants doon na para sa mga bisexual, yung gagawin kang girl. Mm-hmm. So, ang nangyari noon, um, kami yung bumili, ako yung bumili ng wigs niya, mm-hmm. ng outfits niya, mm-hmm. magawa kami ng accessories kasi syempre mm-hmm. limited lang yung ano natin, yung budget. Mm-hmm. Tapos, noon nag-talent show siya, since dancer ako, dancer din yung partner ko that time, mm-hmm. nag-ballroom kami, nag-gumawa oh. kami ng isang uh, number na nilifting ko siya, as in uh-huh, binibot ko siya, uh-huh. nag ko siya parang barbell. Okay, okay. And nanalo siya na best in talent. Oh, mm-hmm. okay. So, what was that like the, 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 start. the start? Yes, kasi kinuha na siya ng bar, ng group ng drag queens doon. Pero kinuha din ako, <laughs> okay. kaso as a male dancer. Oh, all right, so, like, all right. So, dancer ay nila ako for like mga one and a half years then. Mm-hmm. So, then, the, when can you say that you officially started? You were introduced to drag that time. Mm-hmm. So, you were uh, you were immersed with the world of drag queens. When did you like officially start to like get yourself into drag? Uh, ayun, nung isa't kalahating taon ako sa pagiging backup dancer nung ex ko, mm-hmm. uh, Dumating ako sa point na parang hindi sa ano eh, parang gusto ko ng bagong gagawin as a performer. Mm-hmm. Parang bagong motivation, bagong, mm-hmm. basta bagong mundo, pero mm-hmm. as a performer pa din. Oh. So, doon, doon ko na, doon ko naisip na bakit hindi ko itry na, na mag, mag-drag din. Kasi I can paint, mm-hmm. I dance, and sometimes I do lip sync din. Pero mm-hmm. as a male, the, as a male. The male version. Yes, a male version of them. Parang nag-duet kami ng ex ko na, ako yung male part. Mm-hmm. So yun, nung, nung na, naisipan ko na, hindi na ako nagdalawang isip. Sabi ko, try ko na kasi sayang, baka yeah, yeah, yeah. tumatakbo ang oras. Mm-hmm. So yun, gumawa na ako agad na parang. Gumawa na ako ng sailing kong wigs, nangiram na ako ng mga mm-hmm. costume sa mga sa mga friends ko, sa mga naging drag mothers ko. Uh-huh. Shout out sa mga drag mothers ko. Hello, hello! Um, were there any kind of hesitation or were just like, I want, to, I mean, I was born to perform? And I want to do this. What was that like? Like the the yes. ultimate reason? Yes, yes, yes. Nisip ko talaga yon kung after after ko magresign sa bar. Uh huh. Sabi ko gusto ko magapply ng ibang work. Oh. So na try ko na mag magapply kasi hindi talaga siya for me. The Ayun corporate ako. world. Yes, yes, corporate. Okay. Ako talaga. Sabi ko magpo perform talaga ako. Pili ko yung talaga <laughs> yung para sa akin. Ah, uh, all right. And here we are, right? Yeah. Here we are. Fast forward to twelve years. Now the name Precious Paula Nicole. Cool. Was that the first ever name that you had ever since you started? No, not really. Oh, okay. Can we tell a story about, like, can we talk about the yes. first? Okay, what was, like, the start? What was the first well, name you got? Well, since yung Precious Paul and Nicole, di ba, familiar din naman yung mga tao na nakuwapos mm-hmm. na kay Mama Pao. Mm-hmm, Paolo, mm-hmm. Ginamit niya yun as uh, a character in it, Bulaga. Pero before that, meron pa akong isang kinuha rin sa kanya na inspiration na, na name. Kasi meron sila dating telesarya ni Ate Reg. Oh, okay. Na ang ang title is I Heart You Pare. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I remember that. I remember yeah, that. Yeah, and Paolo Balesteros is one of the cast in in that um in this area. And uh ang pangalan nito vodka. Right. Vodka. <laughs> okay. Yes. Uh, so, yun din yung ginamit ko vodka. Tapos since I love Beyonce, uh-huh. ginawa ko siyang ano, uh, vodka fierce. Vodka fierce. Uh, that was the uh, first name. Yes, that was my very first mm. name. Kasi hindi naman nag-work. <laughs> Why not? Vodka fierce. It's like vodka. Cardi B's name, right? Vodka fierce. Oh. Ah, wh- okay, okay. And what transitioned you? Like, when did you realize that that name didn't work out for you? Is it like mm. because of personality? That does it make yeah, a difference? Yeah, oh, parang what? masyadong maangas kasi yung vodka fierce mm-hmm, eh. Mm-hmm. Eh, kasi ako more on, you know, pag-cute lang, <laughs> pag-girl. <Aww. laughs> na parang parang nag, nag-transform lang kapag mm-hmm. na, na, sa drag na mm-hmm. pag nag-bibigyan say na. Pero I also do kasi uh, Regine. Mm, I also yes. Do, uh, yes, I saw that episode. That episode was meant for you, love. You, that episode you. was meant for you. That's yes. amazing. I mean, you have met Regine prior to that, though, right? Many times. Many uh, times. And she approves of, like, the yes. impersonation. Mm. Well, she's a she's a really big fan of drag queens in general. Like, yes. She, she enjoys the world so yeah. much. It's like, no, sobrang supportive niya so mm-hmm. not supportive niya. and I, I just i just have a question what do you mean i mean you guys do lip syncs right and of course you use um 
uh, songs from specific artists and such. Mm -hmm. Do they ask you to pay a specific like fee or fine for oh. that? No? Oh, no, 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 no. They, they, they don't. Never. Aww. Okay, yeah, that, that's awesome, especially for artists, especially nowadays because you know songs are copyrighted and such. When you perform something, especially online, you get you get hit yes. by a copyright and and all of that. It's it's yeah. a very it's a very thin line to thread. Um, but they no don't. pandemic. No pandemic. Uh, we're doing Facebook Live. So, mm -hmm. uh, isang artist lang yung hindi nagbablock ng ano ng, Can ng Facebook Can be named the artist? Si Adderidge. Oh, <laughs> so it's her. So that's why you guys are forever grateful mm -hmm. for her. Oh, that's it. Sweet. Now, um, with the regards to your like your persona as Precious Paula Nicole, what is the inspiration? I mean, aside from of course, um, Paulo Balesteros giving you the name, what is like the inspiration of that? Like, what is the kind of um, mindset that you put yourself in before you become Precious Paula Nicole? Yeah. Before I became Precious, because I, I really admired my my senior queens, the mga kasama ng ex, even my ex. Mm -hmm. She's one of my inspiration talaga kasi ang gagaling nila mm -hmm. lalo pag na-transform na sila. And my drug mothers are my inspirations kasi uh, both of them do uh, Beyonce and Lady Gaga. Mm -hmm. And yung iba naman na uh, seniors ko, magaling din mag-comedy. Oh, okay. Parang so parang ang si Precious kasi is a mixture, mixture of uh, my... Hello? Yeah, I'm sorry. I think there's oh, a problem with this. I, I've been I've been listening to that too. Yeah. I apologize, but yeah, yeah. you yeah. were saying. Uh, Precious Paula is a mixture of my five uh, senior queens. Mm. So I mean them: si Marla, mm -hmm. the my drug moms, and Lady Gagita. Uh huh. Tapos si Captivating Katka, uh -huh. si Jelina, and si Amanda. Ah, uh, so that's like the mixture. Yes, personalities. Yes. Parang pag sila lahat eh pinagsama sama. That's me. Which one of them cries a lot? <laughs> ako lang pala. <laughs> oh my god, so that's ako. your addition to ako na yun. So uh, na yung that, That's your addition. <laughs> I mean, that's what we see on TV. I'm not uh. sure. <laughs> I'm not sure. I know, but I mean, it comes out as genuine. There, there's cries mm -hmm. that comes out as not genuine. But you know, you're one of the very few queens that I see the genuine, like whatever you see on TV is what it is. Like it is, it is, yeah. it is who you are, yeah. right? Yeah, pagulat niya kasi nakalimutan ko na lahat na nangyari yun. So, really? Yuck pala ako dun. Ay, yuck ulit ako. Yuck ulit naman ako. Yuckin pala ako. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now speaking of that, um, I just want to brush off a little bit on your drag race journey. How did that actually, how did appearing in Drag Race P Drag Race PH changed your career in general. Well, ganun pa rin naman nag-show pa rin naman ako as a mm -hmm. drag queen, mm -hmm. but now um ang nakakatuwa kasi is tuwing magpo-post kami ng shows namin, mabilis na sold out yung tickets. Mm -hmm. And like before, before Drag Race, ang kami pa yung nagme-message sa mga tao to to buy tickets, mm -hmm. so parang Na-experience na namin dati na ang ticket namin is 50, ang audience na namin, 10 lang. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, so, grabe yung impact, grabe yung apekto ng, ng drag race kasi um, hindi na kami yung mahanap ng tao, kami na yung mahanap mm. ng tao. Kami na yung gusto mapanood. How do you feel about that? Overwhelming. <laughs> overwhelming. Overwhelming. Kasi lalo na sa, sa social media. Mm -hmm. Dati kapag nag-texture ako ng, ng mga tag video sa akin, Mga tatlo, apat. Mm -hmm. Yun, hindi ko na mga uh, <laughs> so, But you try uh, your best. I always try my best. Po. Kasi, to, to share everyone yes, and tag you. Katulad nung sinasabi ko sa mga friends ko, I was a fan before. I, uh -huh. I know the feeling na hindi, hindi ka nabibigyan ng attention nung, uh -huh. nung tao na ina-idolize mo. So, uh, I always do try my best to mm -hmm. open and to, you know, kahit mag-react na lang, hindi na ma-share or yeah, makapal, yeah. thank you. Kasi, it's, too, it's, it's a lot. It's a lot. Did it did it like change like from zero to a hundred that quick when uh, um, Drag Race PH? Zero to hundred. Really? Mm -hmm. ah, I wonder. Well, because of course you know you're now in mainstream TV. You have international. You have an international audience now. You do. Do you um did someone from like another um franchise. country? Country you know, or another franchise. So let's just put it another well, yeah, franchise. I, I, got, I got to talk na to uh, to Angina. Oh, okay. Yeah, from Drag Race US and then pinafollow na rin tayo ng mga nasa ibang franchise na, so I the know. Blue Eye Ranger. Yes. 
Yay! Ayun, yes! kaya nakakatawa kasi matagal na rin namin gusto silang, you know, maka-interact kasi so wala talagang chance. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And an opportunity. But yeah, Drag Race really opened that. Yes, and you guys are like the awesomest cast. Like the, I don't really, um, I'm not really the uh, familiar with the the drag community here in the Philippines. I am a fan of Drag Race in general. Um, but I was I was scrolling through Twitter. I think that was the episode with the uh, the mythical creatures that everyone was trending. I'm like, okay, and you know, you were mentioned by uh, Queens' biggest Trixie Mattel. And be like, oh my goodness! So, wow, this is just a perfect cast. Man, yeah. How do you feel about that? No, we na kasi kala ko ano lang eh ibang account yung nag share. Aha, aha. Kasi sure, madami kasi mga fan na nagkumagawa ng mga accounts for for their ano mm-hmm. idols. Pero pa nikita ko na may blue check. Blue check. Napa kasi ko talaga. Kinikilig pa ako. Lalo na nung first na nagintro na yung uh, intro na kami sa ay nung nalabas na yung Meet the Queens. Mm-hmm. Tapos isa sa, kasi sa crush kasi Blue Eyed Ranger. So, oh. um, nag-follow siya sa akin. May message ko kagad siya. Blue Eyed <laughs> Blue Eyed Ranger was the winner of um, uh, versus the world. UK versus the world, yes, right? Yes, UK versus the world. Ah, yeah, the one who um, eliminated Pangina. I cannot forgive her for that. But yeah. Why? <laughs> but okay, okay. I hope to see you, Queens, you know, at least from the Philippine franchise to the world. Why not, right? Why not? Nah, no. Yeah, hopefully. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. But yes, we're gonna yes. we're gonna continue on this interview in a bit. Um, meanwhile, here's a track that I heard yesterday that I shouted yesterday that well precious performed yesterday. Beyonce is here with all the like singles. Ah, <laughs> 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 <Yeah. laughs> but yeah, we'll reserve that performance for later. But here it is. Single ladies, we put a ring on it with Beyonce and it's playing right here, right now. It's Moose Hottest. Monster BT 105.9. <laughs> I can't remember to forget you though, Shakira and Brianna. Um, and you know, an epic duet that happened in the I think mid 2010s. And I believe, you know, um, uh, what do you call that? This is one of the songs that people want to lip sync to, um, especially when they're when in their car or when you're a drag performer like Precious, Paul, and Nicole. Welcome back. Hello. Yes, welcome How are back. you feeling? Welcome back, <laughs> welcome back to you. Um, how are you feeling? I'm, I don't feel any pressure right now. You don't feel any pressure. <laughs> Okay. I'm okay, I'm okay. okay. Precious afternoon, DJ right. Hi, hi, and um, a precious afternoon to everyone who actually, it was a sunny day earlier and now it's like, yeah. it's drizzling. So mm-hmm. y'all better be ready with an umbrella yourself. Make sure that you guys, you know, just make sure that you stay dry and you stay sane. Okay, now we're still talking to Precious Paul and Nicole. I'm still in awe to the fact that I'm like, you're literally in front of me. Oh my goodness, I don't know if this is a dream, please pinch me. But <laughs> um, thank you so much for being here and you know taking time off at least while you are here in Cebu. Now I have a question. This is the first time that you're here in Cebu. Um, when you were first invited to perform here in Cebu, was it like an automatic yes? Or was it like, let me just take a look at my schedule and once I have it cleared, then you know, what was that? It's a big yes. Like, uh, <laughs> I told my mm-hmm. answer na kapag merong ganun na invitation, grab Go. it. Go. Yeah. You don't have to ask for my permission because it's always a yes. Aww. Um, And th- w- that was like a one night, right? Like you were expected here to do <laughs> one night. And they were contemplating because the tickets got sold out as quickly as to, at least the meet and greet got sold hours for, uh, got sold in two hours. Did, were you aware of that? Mm, Were you aware? <laughs> no, 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 since I'm staying until uh-huh. Tuesdays. So uh-huh. Oh, you're going to be here on tu- until, yes, until Tuesday? Tuesday. Wow, you, you're going to be, um, what do you call that? You're going to be exploring Cebu. Yes. Uh, can I do, Can I send you some chicharron over yes. your ho- Can sure, I? Sure. Can I? Oh, no man, oh, can no I? Because these the, the chicharron that I always, um, uh, what do you call them, buy, are, are the chicharron that um, my friends from Manila 
always want, like the people from RX Ooh. Manila. Mm -hmm. So I'm probably just gonna send you one. Since I know now I know that you're gonna be here on Tuesday. Thank you. Um, I'm just gonna <laughs> talk to Jace about that and how I can Thank send you. that to I'm you. Excited. <laughs> um, and okay, so um, that that was for the first night. That was your idea. The second night was your suggestion. Did I, did I, did I, did I, uh, yeah, I asked. I asked her to, I know, to, parang ask the Jace. I think na. Mm -hmm. Since na sold out na siya mabilis, ba hindi natin gawin na two nights kasi ayun nga, I'll be staying longer, mm -hmm, so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Aww, okay. And how was the, how was the experience that you had at least for the first night? Um, I love, it. <laughs> I love it, I love it. Is it not like, it, it, I mean, I've, I've been to very little drag shows. Like this is like, you know, 2022 is the first time I've been into a drag show. Is it? not normally like that is it like a th there are times that it's like sit down yes a sit oh, down oh, crowd yes 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 huh. yeah i was really surprised kahapon pagpasok ko pa lang yung mga tao parang hindi na ako pwedeng dumaan <laughs> <laughs> kasi kumaga sa lahat naman ng performers ganun yung ganun, mm -hmm. ganun yung gustong may experience like nakikita ko yung sa reaction kay Ate Rich mm -hmm. kay Michael Jackson kay mm -hmm. Vito mm -hmm. so mga big talaga na ano big, big stars na yung na, naka experience ng ganun so, yun ang nangyari siya kagabi. Grabe yung nakakaiyak. Oh. Nakakaiyak. Nakakaiyak. Yes, sobra, sobra po. Someone... Thank you talaga po. Someone gave you a tissue last night. Too. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Kasi po talaga, sorry. <laughs> Then sobrang naka, naka, ano, overwhelming. overwhelming. Uh, and Ang sarap sa puso na marami pala nagmamahal sa amin dito uh, sa Cebu. Of course. And I believe for the rest of the Philippines, you'll always have people that love and support you. I know there's also a very big drag scene in Davao, um, if you can visit them. Of course, I want with, to. with Lady Morgana, they're a resident drag queen there. Oh, so, absolutely. yeah, hopefully we can do something there. Oh, uh, at saka din ng lady. I so, know, uh, I know. And it, it very, very humble. Um, especially when she's like someone representing like the rest of the the, the Bisaya um, for Drag Race PH. And I'm mm -hmm. amazed with her. Really want to, you know, meet her hopefully soon. Hopefully soon. Yeah. Now, um, going back to your like drag journey, may I, I mean, I think I know the answer, but I also still want to ask who was like the most unforgettable person that you met while you're performing in drag? While performing in drag, uh, unforgettable person. Mm -hmm. Maybe or maybe someone from your family. <laughs> well, yeah, I have I have a video in YouTube sa na nagperform ako with my mom. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Yes, yes. Oh my and, goodness. Uh, Kyan ko yata yung uh, because you love me. By mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yeah, the giving one of the most memorable. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, how about a famous artist? At the edge, <laughs> of course. <laughs> Were you also YouTube then? <laughs> Uh, Were you also, um, what do you call that? Were you also performing as Regine? I was performing as Regine. Actually, nakakatawa nun kasi a week before, mm -hmm. we got invited to perform sa concert niya. Mm. Kasi hindi kami nakapunta kasi syempre may work kami sa bar. Mm -hmm. So after a week, dumating siya. Mm. Na, it was a Sunday night, tapos kung hindi lang yung tao, kalmado lang. Mm -hmm. Kasi usually pag Friday, Saturday, yun yung talagang full pack kami people. na talagang okay. hindi ka nalas makakadaan, makakasayaw. So, dumating siya noon, tapos, uh, honestly, hindi ako mag-religion dapat noon. Oo! Oh. <laughs> okay. Hindi <laughs> naka-Beyonce na ako na uh -huh. na makeup And then, sabi ng manager namin, okay, nandiyan na si Ate Reg. Hmm? Yeah, so, pag-silip ko. Uh, Pakita po natin yung line-up, please. Pakita uh -huh. po natin yung line-up, please. Tapos, <laughs> nagbura ako ng mukha, nagbura mm -hmm. ako ng makeup. Tapos, nagbura ako. Sinakit oh. ko siya, inakit ko siya. Kumanda okay. siya ng live. Oh. Nagulat siya na yung hawa ko palang mic. Live. Live. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm lip sync din siya. Okay. <laughs> so that I mean, so so it wasn't. I mean, was it still pressure? Were you still pressured in Drag Race when you found out? Very much, very much. Oh, huh. so, because iba pa rin kasi yung alam mo yun na nandyan yung taong kakilahin mo eh. Mm -hmm. na, nakakaba kasi konting mali mo lang, syempre. Mapapansin na nung niya, mm -hmm. lalo na siya. Of course. Kasi yeah. niya, kaya niya yung sarili niya. So, in, in, <laughs> hindi, hindi, hindi ako nang sinita the whole day kasi oh. I was so nervous kasi it was her, her. Eh, it can make it or break her. you. Yeah, I know. 
kasi hindi natin alam kung ano magiging reaction din ng mga tao. So, yeah. And I believe you were uh you were um you know, you were you, you felt very validated when she said herself that I don't even know if I'm the real one <laughs> when I see them. She said that, right? Yes, In one of the yes. comments. Um, so, Ganun din naman ako, minsan hindi ko na rin alam kung sino talaga si Regine sa amin. Ah, Woo! <laughs> 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 okay. Yeah, sometimes may ganun. Like, mm-hmm. ako minsan, minsan nagugulat ako sa salamin. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. Ah, okay, so aside from Regine, I also know that you do Beyonce. I saw you do Beyonce yeah. uh, yesterday. Who's who's the other artist that you would like to, I, you like to in person? No, I do, I, I do Madonna. Okay. Katy Perry. Uh, Lady Gaga also. Nag, mm. Nag-transform ako ng marami rin before kasi tinatry din namin. Malay mo, mm. mag-work. Why not, right? And my mom would like to tell you, she told me this, I think, last Friday. She said that, I know you're gonna meet her. Just tell her that she has super fabulous, amazing makeup skills. Because oh. you know the, the things where you you guys have shown while you're doing makeup, right? Yes. And th- she was always in awe when you ultimately, th- the that specific, the the rusical um mm-hmm. episode she was amazed by you she's like oh she can do that she can she she has like epic makeup skills so my mom also wants Thank to say you. that Shout out <laughs> <to> mommy. what's <laughs> her name uh mommy when hi mommy when when will i see you again <laughs> she she's she's in sicky horror actually oh, that's why that's why i'm with the, the kids okay so um uh what do you call that what is well, this is actually about the, the que- I'm following your questions and this is, we're actually about to end, but how about this? Um, with, how do you think has, or how much do you think has drag in as an art form grew from like prior to the pandemic to now? It really changed that I got a big, mm-hmm. like, um, ngayon pwede mo na kaming is, well, <laughs> I mean, stars na rin talaga kaming tinuturing kasi nakikita na rin kami sa TV and mm-hmm. nag-invite na rin naman ng commercials, mm-hmm. music videos. Kumbaga, no. uh, some of us all already have their own songs written, yeah. si Marina and si Minty. Mm-hmm. Kumbaga, um, thanks kay RuPaul and thank you sa mga tao kasi hindi talaga namin ito na expect like, Yeah. Like, ang layo pa nung feeling namin, ang layo pa nung bubunuin bago kami mm-hmm. ma- makapareho, kumbaga, para makasabay sa US drag queens. Mm-hmm. Pero, ayan, nangyari na siya. Kaya, um, konti pa, konti pa. Just, just a and, little bit more. And I'm excited to to see the new queens that's sa season 2. I know. It um, is, conv- there, there is a season 2 that's kind I of hope, I hope, I hope. I believe, I believe. Yeah, really, the, the, the response of the audience is really good. Yes. Oh, oh. Tsaka, yun nga, I already, I already told the girls last night na uh, pag nag season 2, kailangan mag-condition kayo lahat para <laughs> malakas yung, ano, malakas yung, the the what do you call it? the representation mm-hmm. and d- did you expect this representation to not only be in Manila but also different parts of the Philippines? Yeah, because we have Lady Morgana yes, and uh, Gigi Era. I know. Yeah, so many, 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 many. Actually, many, many queens from other other countries are here in the Philippines. I know who wants to audition for Drag Race. So. Mm-hmm. Watch out, I'm so excited na ako. I'm staying excited. Pero sana muna agad. Pero may enjoy muna namin. Yeah! Ay, yeah. <laughs> Ay ganun. Wag po muna. Ay, what? Just, not uh, yet, not yet. Uh, okay, it's not yet. Um, yeah. But uh, I, the, the reason why I asked that, it's because last night, I met someone. Remember that um, that pretty lady that was dancing with you in the stage? Mm-hmm. Um, I, I forgot her name. But she was crying. I saw her crying. Her, uh, you know, she was crying, and she was hugging someone. I think she was with that person yesterday. But she was crying and saying that drag has come a long way since, long. like the 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 time that she was doing drag. Mm-hmm. There was a time that you know people were oh people were not accepting, not uh, not of it as an art form. Mm-hmm. They were just like scrutinizing everyone mm-hmm. who does uh, cross dressing and all of yeah. that stuff. And it's amazing how that yeah. has uh, how how far mm-hmm. we've come as a, like a community itself. And thank you for being part of you know yeah. um, one of the pillars of that community because yeah. oh my goodness you you guys 
drag race philippines would not be possible if it wasn't for like really great and talented drag queens so yeah thank I, you and they even uh received messages like sabi nakarelate sila dun sa yung anak ko eh yung mga mm-hmm. yung uh, mythical creature ko na vlog mm-hmm. kasi sabi nila they're on their way home kasi nga they heard my story uh-huh. so alam mo yun marami yung tungkol sa brother ko uh-huh. Oh, how was your brother, by the way? Uh, <laughs> how is your brother? How is he feeling? He, he's very shy. He's always uh, that shy. Super. Very super, shy. Very, very shy. And, he was so strong and brave. You're proud of him, right? Super. Uh, that he, he braved the actual international stage of drag race. <laughs> <laughs> and dressed up. Yeah, yun, isa sa mga talaga sa akin kasi mm-hmm. expectation ko. Parang, kumbaga, hindi ko siya talaga kahit konti na Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 A very supportive yes, brother, perfect. and you you are one of the the queens that has a very supportive family. So, you know, I'm I'm really happy for you. Now, um, you know, we're we're about to end this conversation. It's all actually four o'clock. What is next for Precious? Next, marami, marami, marami pa lang next na gagawin. Do uh, you know? Kasi bukod sa pag bukod sa pag show, yah, meron din ako ng binubuo na fan racing. Mm-hmm. Of course, nasa na nasa nanta po ng uh, typhoon kaiting tapos mm-hmm. uh, of course malapit na ako mag give back sa golden days yun 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 dahil what? nakita ko yung reaction ng mga tao kagabi, huh? uh, I might bring my two sisters back. Yeah, the Divine Divas! Yes, oh my God! Yes, yes, Jace, yes, yeah, Jace, yes. yes. Somewhere else. Yeah, Somewhere else. Soon. 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 The Divine, the Divine soon. Divas. The Divine Divas. Yes. Yeah. That was with, that was with um, or that is with Venus Deluxe and Brigitte. Brigitte, ding, 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 ding. Oh yeah, now I realize you're the only one left um <laughs> in, the <laughs> in, the, in the last the last two episodes just like swoop them away from you but you know you're you're still there it's still one of three and <laughs> we're still good yeah, we're still no, good. lv La- 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 i know i know now how about this what are what is your advice for aspiring drag artists um, as there i believe will be a lot more especially with the accepting community now what is your advice Yeah, um, always do uh, what you want. Because if you think about it now, let's just start now. Because we don't know when we're going to be afraid, right? Life is short. If you think about it now, find someone who can help you. Mm-hmm. Find inspiration on TV, on music videos. Mm-hmm. Uh, if you think about it now, find someone who can help you. Find inspiration on TV, on music videos. If you think about it now, find someone who can help you. Find inspiration on TV, on music videos. If you think about it now, find someone who Uh, no drag is limitless. Mm-hmm. So, um, uh, know who you're gonna call or you're gonna mm-hmm. ask for help. Because, maraming tao na willing naman to help. Mm, all right. Yeah. And Precious is also here too to help you out, right? And Do you have drag daughters? I have. I have, have six. You have six drag daughters. Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness! Hopefully, we can see them in the main stage. I wish <laughs> I can bring them here. Yes. 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 <laughs> Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Precious, for being here. Thank I you. really appreciate it. One last question before Damn we go. No, man. You're Charmed. right. I, I don't know how many last Joke questions man. I have. <laughs> But what is your favorite song to lip sync to? How about that? I love lip syncing "You" by Carpenters. Oh, so, oh, that's I my didn't. Song for my mom. I didn't expect that. I thought it was gonna be like a hype dancey oh. song. Oh. That's my oh, oh, and have you uh, recorded yourself, or is is have you performed that once yes, before? Yes, many times. Man. Many times. Is it on YouTube? I know. I don't have it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it I is on YouTube. All right. So, yeah. If you if you can't go to Manila 
watch Precious perform that, you can go to um, YouTube to check yes. that out. Thank you so much, Precious. Yes, thank I really you, appreciate it. And invite people, though, the people that are listening on the radio oh, and on Facebook Live to follow you um, for updates. Where can they do yes. that? I have my social media as well. I have on Facebook, mm -hmm. Precious Paula Nicole. Mm -hmm. And so I have Precious Paula Me. Mm -hmm. I also have uh, Twitter, Precious Paula N. Okay. And so TikTok <laughs> naman, Precious Paula Nicole. Okay. Yeah. All right. So you are on all <laughs> social media platforms. <laughs> and, Precious and YouTube, YouTube. Oh, YouTube, yeah, YouTube. Yeah, yung vlog ko na lang. But first, very first vlog ko will, out, will come out tonight. Oh. Yes. Oh. It's amazing. Please follow and subscribe. Yes, so we'll definitely do that. And we have followed you on all your social media platforms. Mm -hmm. And we're looking forward to seeing you um, not only here in Cebu, but on all other islands in the Philippines. You do have a lot of islands in the Philippines, so if you can check that out of your yes. <laughs> bucket list, then just do that. I know you know you deserve what you have now. And thank you again for thank dropping you. by. And uh, before we end, the, uh, or can you please end the show for me? So what I needed to do okay. is what I say Cebu's hottest, you say Monster BT 105.9. Okay. <laughs> monster Radio BT. Mon just monster. Monster. Monster BT 105.9. All right. So again, a precious Paula Nicole, it has been awesome to talk to you. Still have a lot of questions for you, but we're cramped up with time. So we'll talk to you pretty soon. And uh, catch her again tonight um, if you have tickets for the show. It's going to be in um, Crossroads, from so, right? From here? From here, yes, I always forget that. But from here in Crossroad, Vanilla, if you have tickets, I know, you know, it might be raining tonight. Hopefully not, though. But if it is, I suggest you go there because it's one gun. It's going to be one hell of a show. Trust me. I was there last night. It's going to be worth it. So thank you, Precious. Thank Hopefully you. See you soon. And you're still tuning in to Sipu's Hottest. Monster BT 105.9. <laughs> 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 <laughs>